Hi, this is Steve from GSX, and welcome to our video series about GSX Monitor and GSX Analyzer. There will be a whole bunch of videos issued in the next few weeks. Some will be very detailed, some will be more general, some will be about different platforms. So I suggest that you uh, subscribe to our RSS feed off of our blog so you can keep an eye on new ones when they come out. And without further ado, let's get into the content. Thanks. So who is GSX? Well, we've been around for a long time. Uh, we're in our 15th year in the domino space, uh, in our 6th or 7th year on the BlackBerry side of things, and in our 3rd year uh, on the Microsoft side uh, monitoring exchange. And then into 2011, uh, we will be adding SharePoint as another platform that we monitor as well. We've got offices all over the world. We're actually a Swiss company, and we have a very large and diverse and prestigious client base. You, you probably know one of our clients. Um, it says here 550 clients, but some of those are very large multinational. Uh, or large managed service providers that are monitoring multiple and, and, and administering multiple clients' infrastructures. So if you really counted uh, every operating unit and all those different companies, there's probably approaching 2,000 clients, something like that. Um, there's obviously a broad range. Some of these are very large with hundreds of thousands of users and many, many hundreds of servers or smaller organizations with a handful of servers and just a few hundred users. And the products all scale very well so it can meet the needs of those different clients and those different size clients. You know, to go back to the big side, uh, slightly over 30% of the Fortune 100 are currently using GSX to administer uh, their infrastructure. Um, we have three main tools, ServerGuard, is a domino specific product and what it does is, is two main things domino crash recovery and I would include as part of that uh, task hang recovery in an automated and unattended way as well as uh, uh, scheduled maintenance. So let's say that at 2 in the morning the third Tuesday of the month you wanted to run um, compact let's say on certain databases on a particular server GSX server guard would would take care of that automatically and in an unattended way within a timeout window and even do a Windows reboot when it's done if you wanted it to do that and uh, that's what server guards intent is GSX ID manager is intended to automate the the process of creation and maintenance of IDs and accounts today this is a domino specific product but we're uh, working on and pretty deep into development on, on adding other platforms to this and the intent would be to uh, take the, those functions and, and rather than having trained administrators do them, push that uh, repetitive task onto your help desk or service desk or the HR department so that the trained administration resources can, can focus on the things that they're best equipped to do. And then our final product, and which is our probably the one that's most common and probably more of you are familiar with, is called GSX Monitor. GSX Monitor actually has multiple components. There's the monitoring tool for monitoring and alerting when something's not working properly for Domino and or exchange um, for BlackBerry uh, including high availability um, and all the all these environments in, in a cluster format at the same time uh, we, I mentioned before we're adding SharePoint uh, into 2011 uh, and then earlier in 2011 um, IBM Traveler and quicker will be adding some additional functionality on top of what we already do there uh, again there's several components the monitor is what does the probing and the alerting uh, analyzer is a, another dashboard that's a, a website that you can give access to various executives and managers so that they can see the service level that's being provided to the end users uh, giving reports trends statistics etc uh, web enabler and monitor on the fly are different ways to deliver the information that GSX monitor has it has its real-time dashboard that uh, the admins have access to but let's say you wanted to give that access to other people then the web enabler would allow other people to see that kind of same kind of information in a different format without having direct access to change anything that we don't want them to and then monitor on the fly would be uh, delivering a summary of what's on the GSX monitor dashboard to your Blackberry or smartphone device and then finally monoping which which is a monitor for the monitor. So if you're using GSX Monitor and it's doing its job uh, keeping track of your infrastructure and alerting you and your team when something needs to be done, then you're going to come to rely on it. So Monoping is actually going to separately and externally monitor GSX Monitor, make sure it's working, and let you know if it's not. Well, thanks for the time. Don't forget to keep an eye on our blog for the uh, newest videos that will be coming out in the next few weeks. Subscribe to our RSS feed. It will make it a lot easier. And bye-bye. Thanks.